is Bill Cannon from Awesome Engines. Uh, we just got done dyno in Terry Wilson's 582 Pro Street uh, Big Block Chevrolet. It's a uh, Merlin 3 block, 4.6 bore, 4.375 crank, uh, 6.385 rods, Molly pistons. It's got our Pro Flow heads on it. It's got a uh, Victor Junior. It's not ported. It does line up pretty good. It's got a decent little hydraulic roller cam. It's like 650 lift from Comp. And uh, 225, 188 valve. It's got 10.25 to 1 compression. We're running 36 degrees timing on 93 octane fuel. The motor just did 693 horsepower at 6,000. It was still climbing, but it's a hydraulic motor, so we don't recommend turning it over 6. And 720 foot pounds of torque at 4,400 RPM. Uh, it's a really nice motor. It's going in a 66 Chevelle. It was a lifetime car as a super stocker. Terry Wilson is from Washington State and uh, he's really eager to get this and I'm just going to give you a little shot of the motor and let you look at it. There was no v evac on the motor at all and um, we couldn't use a spacer because his car won't let him so we're down probably 30 horsepower. This motor usually does about 725. Anyway, that's the motor. We got him a custom set of valve covers. Uh, they're powder coated silver. As you can see this manifold is a Victor Junior. It's got a nice little Street distributor from ProComp. It works really good for our application. We did put a gear drive in it. It's quiet as a mouse. We don't like a chain on the street. And uh, it's got Moroso's new chassis pan. As you can see, it's a uh, it's just a, a good seven and a half, eight quarter. Like I said, there's no vacuum, no no blow by as you can see in the valve cover. We just left that hole open, and it's a 1,000 CFM carburetor. And uh, it's a badass little piece. It does have the beehive spring. I'd love to show you that, but I can't. I'd have to pull it apart. Other than that, Terry, here she comes.